so welcome back to channel guys and in this video we are going to install this led light on my terrace so you can see this is a 30 watt light ip65 it means it is uh, rated for outdoor use we will need some basic tools like uh, wire stripper or cutter uh, tester to tighten the screws or anchor bolt uh, we will use this anchor bolt to fix this light so that it is uh, permanently fixed and doesn't move around I am going to fix this light on an existing bulb holder so I will need this adapter you can connect the wires here and this will directly attach to the holder and we can power it some cable to extend the wire because the length of wire given with this light is very short uh, some heat shrink tubes soldering iron set and solder wire paste and everything as usual we'll also need one uh, drill machine hammer drill machine to fix this uh, fastener so i will show it to you later so let's prepare the light in preparation what we'll do we will just uh, attach this cable here the length of wire is a uh, little bit long we'll cut it as per our need when we install this light okay so let's start with the soldering so I have plugged in the soldering iron to heat it up. Now let's prepare the wire. I will measure the length of wire and remove the outer setting. And then we will again measure the wire. It doesn't need a lot. This much is enough I think. Let's twist the strands together. Now we will take the appropriate heat shrink tube. I think this one will fit it here. Let's cut two pieces. Now let's insert the heat shrink tube in one of the conductors so if you see this red one and blue one are the are for the supply and this uh, yellow and green stripe a wire is for our thing so we don't need it right now <coughs> the wire is only two conductors we are going to use only the phase and neutral now I think the soldering iron is in iron is hot yes it is working now let's let's tune the wire this step is very important if you don't flex it well or tint the wire it's not gonna stick together yeah this is enough now let's cut the wire to the appropriate size just like that now let's join the blue one with the greenish one or bluish one and white with the red one keep the wires together i'm going to use this jig Some solder here okay so this is fixed let's do the same with the other wire the red one take some solder okay. Solder them together. So you can see both the wires are attached now. Now just cover the wires with the heat shrink tube like this. Okay, and also let's cut this wire because we don't need it. Let's cut it little short. So that it will not bother it now let's take another heat shrink tube which is suitable for this thick wire I think this will do let's measure it and cut the required length and insert it over the wire
something like this okay but before shrinking the bigger one let's uh, heat shrink this the small ones so for that i will use a heat gun you can use a lighter or a match stick as well okay so let's shrink the heat shrink tubes it is very important to protect the uh, other devices or nearby things uh, from the hot air from this hot air gun so for that i am using this box in which this light came to block the heat okay so let's shrink it let's keep it a uh, little bit far otherwise it will get shrink and you won't be able to okay be very careful the hot air is very hot it's very hot you can burn yourself so be mindful of what you are using okay now let's insert this let go i think it's little to try but i think we don't have any other option now yeah this is done okay so again let's shrink it okay you can remove this now and let it cool you can see this connection is done properly now let's go to the terrace and fix it okay so i am at the terrace and i would like to install it uh, somewhere like this here yeah i think this is a good position so let me make a mark here Hope this is visible in the camera okay so this is the mark where i would be installing the light now let's keep the light aside and i've already prepared the drill bit here so it matches the size okay and i've also set the depth okay now let's uh, drill it out fix this uh, stand it would be easier if we remove this light from here so uh, let's quickly do it now uh, there's just two screws here i will simply remove it this done and now we will fix this stand with the help of this fastener okay so the uh, trick is simply uh, just uh, loosen it a bit 1 or 2 mm so that we can tighten it later and simply put it here insert it and hammer it now the only thing left is to reattach it so i am not sure if it is visible in the camera or not but it's similar to what we did to open it right so just uh, tighten these two screws and you are done uh, now you can adjust the angle depending upon the requirement and tighten the screws so i think this is the perfect angle for me okay Okay, so now let's route this uh, cable. We need to route it like this, and we need to connect it on this bulb holder. Okay, so to organize the cable, we will use this cable clips, small cable clips, right? So let's start fixing those. I am just keeping some slack wire so that this can be tilted up and down without any issue. and finally 
we'll simply hammer it okay keep your fingers safe while hammering it's very important Okay, I think the wire length is already good. I need not to cut anything. This is fine. So let's uh, connect this adapter here, and we'll test it out. Okay, so now let's connect this adapter. We'll just open it. We'll insert the cap on this side. Strip the wire like this. Twist them together. Hold them on back side. Loosen these screws. Insert the wire facing downward. Tighten the screw. And do the other wire from the other side. Just like that. Tighten the screws. Tighten the screws well. Now tighten the cap. Remove the bulb and plug in the adapter. Okay, so this is how it is connected. Now let's test the light. So you can see the light is on yeah so this was the very simple way how to install a light so that's all for this video guys hope you like this video and found this video informative please like and share if you find this video helpful and i will see you in the next one